Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Microsoft Store Error is a very common problem on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So if you're getting any kind of errors like this, Microsoft Store Error 0x000190 or 73D05, or 4 times F, all these error or any other Microsoft Store error if you're getting, follow these simple three steps and we will be able to fix this problem. So in the search icon, type WS reset. So once you have typed WS RESET, this will actually remove all the cache temporary files, all the junks from the Microsoft Store. This is, this is a very good thing to do. And you should, the first step should be this. So once you have run this command, this might take four or five minutes. And once this is done, the Microsoft Store will open up automatically. You can see here the Microsoft Store is opened automatically right now. If you still have issues, what you can do is here in the search icon, type troubleshoot. And you will find the best match troubleshoot settings. Now Microsoft Store error for Windows 11 or Windows 10, the procedure will remain same. The steps will remain same. So I'll click on troubleshoot settings. And here we need to click on other troubleshooters. Once you click on that, a new window will appear and you need to scroll down and look for any option which says Windows Store Apps. So you can run the troubleshooter and this will start detecting the problem for Windows Store and Windows Store Apps as well. So this is a very good thing to do. All these steps are actually very good for the system. Once this is done, you can restart the computer and see if that's working. If not, the last and very effective step is to click on the search icon and type CMD and run as an administrator. Please make sure you click on run as an administrator and then it will ask you to say yes and a new window will appear like this. And here we need to run a Microsoft system file checker scan, which is SFC space forward slash scan. Now I'll just maximize it so that we can type. Once you have done that, hit enter, and this will start scanning the whole computer and it will fix the problem. This procedure might take five to 10 minutes. And once this is done, please restart the computer. Let me know in the comment section if it has fixed. And if you have any kind of issues, please let me know. I'll try my best to fix your problem. I need your support. Please hit the like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next tutorial. Have a wonderful day.